domestic markets, revenues are up 5%, thanks to the good commercial activity across all the networks and all the specialized services. I remind you that in those specialized services, we have, for example, Arval, our fleet leasing, revenues up 20%. We also have Nickel, our alternative banker services, up more than 20%. And so that's that part. And then if you look at international financial services, they picked up with very strong net inflows. And then CIB, well, they continued their strong commercial momentum driven by all of its businesses, confirming its position as a European leader with market share gains across all of the businesses. So that's why. So BNP Paribas is doing well, but each of its businesses is doing very well. We are entering an environment of higher interest rates. Of course, that's also because there, so that could be a good tailwind, of course, for, for banks and for BNP Paribas, but that's also because we've seen inflation persisting, um, which could be a headwind. So how are you positioning your business in this environment that we see um, coming into 2022? But if you look at the overall planning that we take as a base around which we, we work everything out, we basically took a very conservative stance on it. Yeah, And so that's basically what we do. So if there would now be interest rates picking up to reflect a step up in the economy, well, we will be there to accompany that and, and take the benefits from it.